Hello everyone, my name is Eric and today I'm excited to launch pig.dev. Pig is an API for automating Windows applications using AI. We expose a high level natural language interface that allows you to connect your computer and send automations to it, such as open a window, open Excel, run these calculations. We're targeting legacy Windows applications that historically haven't seen much love from the developer community, but the reality is they power the world. Everything from airlines to insurance to electronic health record software is running on Windows applications that don't have an API. The goal of PIG is to be that API, to provide the highest level of natural language abstractions down to the lowest level, click at coordinates, press keys, and everything in between to allow teams to build the fastest, cheapest, most robust automations possible to save the rest of their team all of the busy click work. Let's show you how it works. First, let's set up our Windows machine. We go to pig.dev, app, and self-host with Piglet. Piglet is an open source computer driver that we install from GitHub. Using our API key, we connect it to the pig server. You can see here, we have a machine connected now. Now on any other computer, we could see the same machine and open up a chat with it. With this chat, we could do pretty much anything. In this case, let's have it describe what's on the screen. What's happening now is pig is running an AI agent in order to take screenshots and perform the correct actions needed in order to resolve the query. In this case, simply summarizing what is on the screen. And now let's do something interesting, testing the capabilities of the mouse. Because the agent works entirely off of screenshots, it's able to guess the coordinates of, in this case, the minimize button, as you see. Mouse over it and click it. Up next, let's run an Excel workflow by launching Excel from the launcher. We see a very interesting case here where an unexpected pop-up comes up. But thanks to the flexibility of AI, we're resilient to small changes like this and are able to continue to the task. Pig is now open access. You can try it out for yourself at pig.dev.